Okay guys, on this tutorial, we're just going to do a brief, quick showing of how to get a picture up on your, on this screen right here. On this one right here. I just got done adding a couple, three pictures. Thought I was making a tutorial for you guys, but my camera wasn't working, so, or my screen capture software. So I'm going to redo it and show you again how I did it. So we're going to go back into your WordPress back office. And to make it simple, uh, we'll go to, go to posts. I'm just going to add a picture to a post that's already here. So we'll go down. Uh, let's see. Make your next payday your biggest. We can find a picture for that. So now you're in here where you got your post. You're going to want to scroll down where you see custom fields. And in this value is where you're going to enter, enter your picture. So we need to go find a picture. So we're going to go to images.google.com. And that post was about a big was about your next big payday. So, we'll get something about, well, we'll type that in, B-I-G, big, big payday. <clears throat> yeah, nothing much there, so, type in money, and we got lots, lots of pictures of money. So we're looking for a picture that is around 588, or around 600 by 400. So this is 600 by 450. It's a little big. 400 by 384, a little small. This is a good size. Um, I've used that on a few other ones, though. So let's see what else I can find. You see it shows the size here, like this one, 310 by 276. Looking for something a little bit bigger. And we'll go back. Now we'll go ahead and use this one, 492 by 340. It's a little small, but it'll work. Click it, come over here where it says see full size image. Click it, right click on the full size image. Go down to properties, click properties. Down here at the bottom where it says alternate text. Copy that URL there. Go back to your post. Go back down to custom fields. Here where it says add new custom field. Paste the, the image URL and the value. In the name you want article IMG, article image. Click add custom field. Now, <clears throat> he's got this in CPA marketing, which is fine. That's the category he wants it in. But the, the screen, the feature screen on the front runs off the one that you called your blog. So whatever you are, Suzanne's blog, Nick's blog, Kevin's blog, also check that because that's what's going to start running the big screen. Update your post. Now we'll go back and look at it. Visit site.
And there's the picture I just put in. Simple as that, guys. Um, let's go back in and we'll add one more so you guys are clear. <clears throat> back in. Back to posts. Oops. Posts. Let's see. Weight loss, pay per click, base payday, better golfer. Discover how you can burn Wii games from home. We'll do that. <clears throat> so we want to go find us a picture about Wii Wii's or Wii games. So we'll go back to Google Images. Type in Nintendo. Nintendo Wii. And find us a picture again around 600 by 400. The bigger, the bigger it is, the nicer it fills up the screen. So and these are all running about the same size. Um, check one more page. This picture is going to be close enough to the same size. Full size image. Right click. Properties. Nah. I don't like that size. What we got here? This is a good size. Down to properties. Copy the code for URL. Copy. Back to your back office. Back down to custom fields. Here's the URL you just got from the picture. Select article IMG, add custom field. He's got it categorized under games, which is fine. Now we need to categorize it under Kevin's blog. Update post. Visit site. And we should have a picture of a Wii on there now. There you go. There's the picture we just put. Alright guys, catch you on the next video.